Hello, this is David Hale with Tech Dive TV Help Desk. Today, we're going to talk about Windows Update. So all you Windows users gather around, listen to your computer very closely. Um, all you Mac and Linux users, you can certainly watch and say, <laughs> we don't have to put up with that. Uh, someone asked me the other day if Windows Update takes a long time. Well, kind of like asking somebody, how long does a tank of gas last? You don't know. If you drive a long way, it doesn't last very long. If you don't drive at all, it lasts a long time. So, you know, can't really say. Depends on what updates in Windows Update are being brought down to you and installed on your computer. It can, however, take quite a long time, especially on older machines, because they're not as fast, they take longer to process, and their disk drives may be more fragmented than newer machines. So, you have to be patient with Windows Update. You have to let it finish what it's doing. It says a lot of times, don't turn off your computer until the update's done or something to that effect. They mean it. Don't turn off your computer in the middle of an update. You could make it so you couldn't reboot your system. It has to actually rewrite files. And if it's in the middle of rewriting a crucial operating system file and you turn off the computer, then that file is no longer any good. And when you try to reboot, it can't use that file, and many times your computer will not reboot. In that case, what you have to do is either see if you can find the file and put it back on, or reinstall the operating system from start, which means reinstalling all your applications. Uh, it could be a, a very scary thing, so please be patient, let your updates finish, and please don't skip your updates. They're important. Many of them are security updates, for people who are out there trying to get into your computer, Microsoft is trying to protect you from those malicious people. So make sure you do your updates when you're supposed to. Um, you can set your updates to be installed automatically, which is always a good thing. And just, you know, let them finish. It tells you in a percentage of how much time is left on the update. So just, you know, go get a cup of coffee or, you know, watch some television or do something else. Get your mind off it. Come back later, see if your computer's done. But make sure it gets done properly. This is David Hale with Tech Dive TV Help Desk. Have a great day.